How do muscles grow? Today I will tell you all about how muscles grow based on science. The first key trigger for muscle growth is mechanical tension. This is the direct physical stress placed on your muscle when you lift a heavy weight. Your muscle fibers, when put under a significant load, sense this tension. This is a primary signal for your body to adapt and get stronger, prompting a biological response to become more capable of handling that stress in the future. The second trigger is muscle damage. When you train, especially during the eccentric or lowering phase of a lift, you create tiny micro tears in your muscle fibers. This is a necessary part of the process. Your body responds to this damage by sending in proteins and repair cells, which rebuild the muscle fibers. This cycle of breakdown and repair is known as hypertrophy, making the fibers thicker and larger over time. The final trigger is metabolic stress. This is that intense burning sensation you feel during high rep sets. It's caused by a buildup of blood and other metabolic byproducts like lactic acid in the muscle. This creates a state of cell swelling. This environment encourages your body to reinforce the muscle to handle future stress more efficiently. After your workout, the real growth actually happens during the recovery phase. This is when muscle protein synthesis really kicks in. Your body uses amino acids from the food you eat to rebuild the damaged muscle tissue. This repair phase can last for about 24 to 48 hours, which is why proper sleep, nutrition, and rest are just so important. There are two main types of muscle growth. Myofibrillar hypertrophy builds dense, strong muscle fibers, which is great for improving strength. On the other hand, sarcoplasmic hypertrophy increases the fluid and glycogen inside the muscle cell, giving you a fuller, more pumped look. The best training plans incorporate both low and high rep ranges to activate both types of growth. To grow muscle efficiently, you need to combine smart training with proper recovery. For your workouts, focus on compound lifts with good form. Aim for a rep range of 6 to 12 with enough weight to reach near failure, and perform 3 to 5 sets per exercise with short rest periods. So, for nutrition, protein is essential. You want to aim for about 1.6 to 2.2 grams of protein per kilogram of body weight to really give your muscles the building blocks they need. Carbs will fuel your workouts and fats are crucial for supporting your hormones and your overall health. Finally, don't underestimate the power of sleep. During deep sleep your body releases a significant amount of growth hormone, which is vital for tissue repair and growth. You should aim for 7 to 9 hours of quality sleep per night to maximize your recovery and muscle building potential. By understanding and applying these three key triggers and focusing on proper nutrition and recovery, you can build a stronger, more muscular physique. It's really all about training smart, not just training hard. If this video was helpful, comment on your progress, subscribe to the channel and like the video.